Hi everyone, Josh Smith with GottaBeMobile.com. Inside this black box is Google Glass. Google just expanded the Explorer program, which is their beta version of the new Google Glass wearable technology that they offer. And they've rolled out a version 2. So here we have a new version. It includes a mono ear pad and uh, a little bit more. Supposedly, this version will work better with prescription lenses. A simple card telling us where we can go for help getting set up. And we're expecting a phone call later today from Google to tell us more about these devices. So here we go. Inside, underneath all of this, is our first look at Google Glass in tangerine orange. It's available in a variety of colors. As we take a closer look at glass, we have the area back here where you can listen with a bone conduction microphone. We have a power button right here in the middle. And then this is where we touch to control with gestures forward, back, up, down, or a tap. There's a button here you can tap to capture uh, photos and videos, or you can use your voice. And then this right here, of course, is the glass part of glass, because there is nothing here in the front. Um, everything is actually in the device. So what you have here is the camera and the prism that you actually see stuff while you have this on your head. Again, a very flexible type of device. And now let's take a closer look at what else comes in this box. As we dive deeper into what comes with glass version 2, we get a pouch here. It says handcrafted using Japanese microfiber. I have a glass logo down here on the bottom, a hard part here. And as we pull this out, here we get a look at the actual monopod or the mono earbud that you can plug into the side of glass for longer calls. So we'll pop that out of the packaging and there you go that is what the version 2 Google Glass earbud looks like and that will plug into your glass. We'll show you a closer look at that here in a second. Nothing else here in our accessory pouch but there is a nice hard layer here so you can store your Google Glass without it breaking. Again, this is the Explorer Edition, so the version that will arrive in retail stores is going to be much different um, and hopefully come with a much cheaper price tag. Here is your power cord, and or your power adapter, and your power cord. Looks like we're just using a standard micro USB, but it's a nice flat design here. So the final part is the new shades. So these are in a partnership with Maui Gym, and I believe one other company, and they offer a way to basically get sunglasses on your Google Glass. They come also in a microfiber pouch which slides out here and we can open this edge up and slide the actual shades out and so there are the shades with a cutout over here on the right for the Google Glass. So again, this is Josh Smith with GottaBeMobile.com. This is Google Glass version 2 for the Explorer program. We have the mono earbud that fits in and plugs right in here. This earbud will also work with the first generation, uh, but Google's offering an Explorer trade-in. So if you had the first generation, you'll be able to switch and get the new generation. These are the new shades that are available. You can also get this in clear if you want uh, basically something that looks like uh, regular glasses, regular prescriptions. And so the mono earbud hangs, pulls out, and these shades basically just slide in over uh, in between the nose bridge area. And you can pull them out, set your shades aside, and then put on your Google Glass like so, like we've seen many times before. You have adjustment here and then you can basically find the right spot for this little prism and pair it with your phone. 
works with Android for the full experience, including SMS alerts and directions. But what's also interesting is it will work with the iPhone for pretty much everything else. Uh, you can install apps, glassware, stuff like that. So stay tuned to GottaBeMobile.com. We have a couple people with Google Glass now. We're going to be showing how this works as well as taking a deeper look at wearables as we move into the end of 2013 and into 2014. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more and leave comments letting us know your questions about Google Glass and we'll do our best to answer them.